No Time to Die is a spy thriller film directed by Kerry Joji Fukunaga and starring Daniel Craig as James Bond, the legendary British secret agent. The film opens with Bond retired from MI6, at peace on the coast of Jamaica. But he soon pulled back into action when his old CIA buddy Felix Leiter, Jeffrey Wright, asks for his help in finding a missing scientist named Valdo Abrachev, David Densick. The mission takes Bond to Europe, where he encounters his arch-nemesis Ernst Stavro Blofeld, Christoph Waltz. As well as the mysterious Safin, Rami Malek, who's harboring dark secrets. With my six colleagues Moneypenny, Naomi Harris's, and Q, Ben Wishaw, at his side, Bond discovers a plot that threatens the world and he must race against time to prevent it. Along the way, he teams up with Nomi, Lashna Lynch, the new 00 agent, who's poised to take over the mantle of James Bond in the future. No Time to Die provides explosive action, high-tech gadgetry, exotic locations, and of course, witty one-liners. Coming to the review of this film in No Time to Die serves as both a worthy swan song for Daniel Craig's portrayal of James Bond, and a fitting end for his journey as the iconic character. The film is a thrilling ride from start to finish. With breathtaking action sequences and a taut plot that keeps the audience on the edge of their seats. The cinematography by Linus Sandgren is exquisite, beautifully capturing each setting with vivid colors and stunning imagery. Craig's performance as Bond is pitch perfect. Embodying the grit and wit that the character is known for, while also displaying a vulnerability that makes him all the more relatable. The ensemble cast brings their A-game, with standout performances from Lynch, who commands the screen as Nomi, and Malek, whose portrayal of Safin is chilling and menacing. The film screenplay, penned by Neil Purvis, Robert Wade, Fukunaga, and Phoebe Waller-Bridge, manages to balance the action with character development, and the result is a well-rounded and emotionally satisfying story. The movie's themes of mortality, legacy, and self-sacrifice give the film a deeper meaning that elevates it beyond a simple action flick. Moreover, No Time to Die marks a significant progression for the James Bond franchise in terms of representation and inclusivity. The film features Lynch as the first black 00 agent and the future of the James Bond mantle, and casting choices such as Ana de Armas and Dolly Bensala show strides towards a more diverse cast. However, the film is not without its flaws. The runtime of the movie, coming in at nearly three hours, could have been trimmed down without sacrificing the story's integrity. Additionally, while the movie's themes carry weight, the script at times can feel convoluted and bloated, detracting from the overall experience. In conclusion, no Time to Die is a worthy addition to the James Bond franchise, delivering thrilling action, engaging characters, and a story that examines the character's legacy. While the film is not a perfect one, it is a fitting send-off for Daniel Craig and sets the stage for the future of the James Bond franchise. Please support us through subscribing and sharing videos with your friends. See you with next video.